Entering this season, expectations are high for the West Morris Wolfpack. The team finished 14 and 10, third in the national division, but rebounded to capture the District One Championship a year ago. For longtime head coach Ken Rossi, having such an experienced team helps them overcome the loss of certain wrestlers due to the football season, as well as to be able to hit the mat running in preparation for the upcoming season. Enabled us to move a little bit quicker in practice, and you know, start with you know basics, but add some more advanced stuff as we go. Um, we work ethic and you know drilling intensity and that stuff. They're kind of setting the tone for that early, which is great. You know, uh, Fleming, Sickles, Karkov, Matthews, Cratch, Welsh. Um, you know, they're some of our core seniors, and those guys, and you know, they know what's expected, and then the young guys can kind of emulate that, and they know they're going to be okay. One wrestler the incoming athletes can look up towards for work ethic is John Sickles. Sickles, whose brother Mike also wrestled for Rossi, knows that a great season starts in these early days of practice. Said wrestling is like a big thing in my family. My dad's done it, my brother's done it. Um, it's just an important thing. And uh, Rossi pushes us in the room, and uh, we're like one of the best conditioned teams, I would say. And in the off season, I've been working a lot uh, harder. Me and Nick Matthews have been going up to uh, his uncles and working out there. So. Another senior, Brandon Karkoff, has taken a prominent role of leadership amongst the squad. Karkoff, who finished second at 132 a year ago, and the other upperclassmen have been working with the incoming freshmen to help maintain the success of Wes Morris for years to come. A lot of kids coming in, they're new, they don't really know wrestling as well as like us seniors. And we didn't lose a lot of seniors last year, so we still have pretty much the same team except minus one or two guys who were hurt most of the, team, most of the year last year. So we're just working on our basic stuff and trying to improve on that. For the West Morris Wolfpack, this is a season full of promise. With a roster loaded with experience and depth at key positions, there's no reason to think that this team can't make a lengthy run this year. They should finish near the top of the national division, and if they can get a favorable draw in a killer sectional bracket with both Roxbury and Warren Hills, then it would not shock me to see Wes Morris claim a sectional title. For MorrisCountyHSWrestling.com, Donald J. Brower reporting.